Do you believe in a paradise on earth? The new earth. The paradise. In Luke 23, 43, Jesus said just before dying, Truly, I tell you today, you will be with me in paradise. Today's civilization suffers a severe problem worldwide. Schools are not focused on training people to become good parents. We are just taught what is needed to obtain a job and become part of the system, leaving new generations in hands of uneducated parents, creating dysfunctional families and consequently, children full of traumas and unhappiness. But we can change the way civilization works and create a paradise, a family-oriented way of living as a civilization. What is the paradise mentioned by Jesus? The Jewish believed in a paradise described in Isaiah 11, 9. They will not cause any harm or any ruin in all my holy mountain, because the earth will certainly be filled with the knowledge as the waters cover the sea. In Genesis 2, 8, 9, the Bible also associates the Garden of Eden with knowledge in a center point in which every tree that was pleasing to look at and good for food, and also the tree of life in the middle of the garden, and the tree of the knowledge of good and bad. Ancient scripts also talk about ancient paradises on earth, such as the Atlantis cities which we would like to describe and reinstate. There were many Atlantis civilizations dating back around 200,000 years ago. Those cities were initially funded by Arcturians. A race of ancient astronauts that were scientists by nature, beings of love. Atlantis places were true paradises on Earth, a forgotten golden era lost in time. The first Atlantis cities consisted of a center island, a ring of water, another ring of land, followed by a ring of water and an outer ring of land. The center island was populated by single people only, in which nudity was publicly accepted and people were thought how to live a life in harmony with their body, mind, and spirit for pursuing true enlightening and true love. After exploring, understanding, and accepting all aspects of their nature, they were able to choose the best fit life partner. The second island as a ring of land was populated by spiritually matured couples who fell in love in the center island. Those couples were trained to become parents and they had to pass the parenting education and evaluations before becoming parents. Those couples qualifying for becoming parents were able to move to the third island or outer ring of land to raise their families. That way, new generations were born in optimal conditions to parents with the appropriate wisdom and preparation for the important job of raising kids. We, Arcturians, are still here on Earth, and our mission is to elevate the love and vibration of the planet by implementing processes and procedures for humanity to live happily in harmony with nature. If this cause resonates with you, we need your help with this idea to recreate the new Atlantis to bring paradise back to Earth. Fear and hate are trying to quench our efforts, but we believe in what we've done in the past, and we are confident that we will succeed in our future accomplishments and in our mission. We have outlined in detail how the economic system worked in Atlantis as a micro-democracy economic system. Jesus said just before dying, Truly, I tell you today, you will be with me in paradise. Luke 23, 43. Do you now believe that a true paradise on earth will be possible? If you like our videos, please subscribe and enable the notification bell.